Okay, hello David. Uh, we got to stop meeting like this. What I'm going to do is I'm going to show you the front of the house and I'm going to walk through it. I've already been through it once. I'm going to walk through it uh, now and, and try to give you a sense of the uh, interior. So I'm walking up to the front door here. Walk inside. Look to the left. That doorway you see there goes to the dining area. That uh, is probably a family room or what you might want to use as a sitting room, not sure. Go back around. There's a uh, fireplace in that next room. These, this front room and the dining room both have 12 foot ceilings. That doorway you see there leads to the master bedroom which is where I'll go next. This also has 12 foot ceilings that get reduced down as I go back. I'm 6'3 and my head hits that, ar hits that archway so that's about the height of that and now I'm in an 8 foot ceiling area that's part of the master bedroom. I'll back up a little bit so you can see that archway but this is all one big room. So this is that large bedroom size they have on the listing. Now you go down the hallway here. Got a closet here to the left. And another closet across the hall, which is to the right coming down the hallway from the front of the house. Hot water heater. Stuck back there in a little cranny. And then I continue down the hallway and I come to the uh, master bath. Got one sink. Got a jetted tub. Looks out back to the swimming pool. Shower, glass block wall, and the water closet. Okay, I'm going to hurriedly back, walk back out of this master bedroom. And this is the view from the window facing the Beach Street out over the, the river. Yeah, I'm in the living room now. Same view. Okay, now I'm back at the front door looking out. Come back around. You remember this pan before? I'll walk to the left. Into the dining area. Again, 12 foot ceilings in here. And from here we go into the kitchen. Oh, I'm sorry, we've got the uh, same front river views from the dining room. We go back into the kitchen. The kitchen is uh, quite a bit more updated than the rest of the house. There is uh, considerable work to be done here. And if you like the cabinets and the countertops, the sink, the appliances are all in good condition. You probably want to update that refrigerator. This is a side door out to the driveway. This is your laundry area right off the kitchen. Washer dryer, hookups. Now we've got another hot water heater and a uh, closet with the uh, electrical panel. 
now we're into that room. Let me see if I can go right here. There's a front window, a front door. So we're in that room I referred to as a potential sitting room or parlor. Uh, this is an eight foot ceiling. Good sized room. Another archway leading into another larger room that uh, could have multiple uses as well. Family room, sitting room, parlor, game room, pool table, you name it. Walking towards the back of the house to another hallway. This is a dead end this way to the right. And there's the uh, uh, attic space that you could get into. Um, and then here's a little closet at the end of this hallway. So that's that. Now we'll go back down the hallway. Here's your uh, a closet for the uh, air handler for the air conditioning. It does have central air. And here we have a a bedroom. Again, eight foot ceilings, ceiling fan. Closet, not real large. And then off of this bedroom, there's another full bath. Make that a dated bath. Tub, good shape, and shower. Matching coral tile and green. So that could be, a, this could be an ensuite um, with its own bathroom. And by the way, it's got its own outside entranceway too that uh, goes out to the pool area, out the backyard. I'm going to take two videos with this house because the inside is so large. I'm going to do the outside separately. Okay, here's what you would call the third bedroom, which is also located in the back of the house right next door to the second bedroom. And this has its own bath as well, another ensuite with just a shower, not a tub. <clears throat> So, that pretty much covers it. This is the third bathroom closet but that is a quick overview of the interior of the house. Now again I'm standing in a third bedroom. I'm going to walk out. There's the second bedroom. That light you see in the background is the bath for the second bedroom. This is a hallway. Right to the immediate right is the air handler. Going back out, large archway, big game room, looking towards the front of the house. The parlor next door. And we go back in here through the kitchen. Uh, water heater closet, pantry, side entrance door, washer dryer, the kitchen. This is not granite, it's just a, uh, it's a hard glossy Formica countertop, flat top range. Again, back out from the kitchen to the dining room. The river view out the front. Back around into the big main living room. Huge room. 